I'm Carrie Gracia and I am the Senior Director of Community Health Programs for the YMCA. Out of our partnership with Moffitt Cancer Centers and their Survivorship and Wellness Program, we were able to partner again on a research project called Project Rally. Project Rally is a pickleball program that we offered at our Greater Palm Harbor location and it is for cancer survivors to come together and have a wonderful time playing pickleball, getting healthy, being active, and being part of our community here at the YMCA. Well, my name is Jackie Rowe. I've been a member for less than a year and is part of the Project Rally program because I'm a cancer survivor. So I have multiple myeloma that's cancer that's not curable, but fortunately it's treatable. So I underwent chemotherapy. Then the recommendation was that I have a stem cell transplant. So in the same year, diagnosed in May of 2019, December of 2019, I had a stem cell transplant. I've been on chemo, though, for five years. One of the side effects is this growly voice that I have. But if that's the only side effect I have, I'm very happy. I'm very active. Uh, I, I was so happy when I heard about the Project Rally program from Moffitt because I had been looking for something to do, you know, you, we've gone through the pandemic, you know, with a stem cell transplant, I was virtually a hermit in my house for three years. I've always had this thing of I want to play pickleball because I played tennis uh, and it was something as at my age, ooh, I can do this. I go to Moffitt every three months to have blood work and all that kind of stuff and uh, talk to this Nate guy and he told me about the study that he was doing and I'm one of these um, proactive people. <laughs> and I said, okay, I'm going to do this. Met Alex, he gave me up some tests to do. I passed the test. So I joined the group. This is a grant-based study. And so we're trying to get more grant money. All of us, all us cancer survivors, we raised our hands saying, hey, we want to continue the program if we can, because it has been the most fun, the most rewarding to be able to be amongst other cancer survivors that want to be active. I had the privilege of coming to visit on multiple occasions when the pickleball group was getting together to play here at the branch. And it was wonderful to see the members greet each other and be excited to play against each other. And they had fun. They were laughing, having a great time. They were counting how many volleys they hit. It was really a great experience for me to see them have a great experience at our YMCA being around people that are at the same level as you are. And I don't know if it's special with cancer survivors, but if you miss hit something or, you know, the ball whizzes past you or whatever, we laugh. Laughing is one of the most important things you should do. Belly laughing is the type of thing you should do every single day. And pick a ball <laughs> with, with the Project Rally people was, makes that happen. It is a wonderful thing for cancer survivors to exercise and be normal and get out into the community and not be at home and make new friends with other folks that are like-minded and, and have similar goals um, to just play, have fun, and build community. Project Rally and the Y changed my life because it gave me something to do on Tuesdays and Thursdays. You know, when you're when you are a cancer survivor, you know, one, you're wanting to, you know, you hear being active, uh, being social, all those types of things. I have something that I look forward to, and that's why the YMCA is so important. I did the smart start, so now I'm getting my muscles. Still, after five years, I don't have any symptoms other than the, the side effects of the chemo drug, you know. So how, how lucky can you be?